All right, what's going on everybody? It's Jake in today's video I'm going to show you guys how to get enchanting to hundred as quickly as possible Now first thing you're gonna to want to do is go to a place called halted stream camp It's right here by right run white run and white run stables. I'll show you where it's at on the map right now And it's very easy to get to literally you just have to walk over here and it's the two little like stick things So like a TP looking thing pretty much. It's just a bandit outpost now There's five steps to this little guy that I've come up with and or not that I've come up with but the five steps clearly that you could see so the first step is getting transmute that's why we're coming to this uh halted stream camp uh the whole reason is because i think you cannot buy it from any other vendor you'll have to let me know in the comment section below but it looks like we've got a visitor that's unfortunate anywho oh uh, 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 that load in oh man that was gross we're here we're gonna be met with some resistance there's gonna be like four or five bandits in this place not a big deal at all literally very easy place to take on at a low level, I would take this mage out first because we are a Nord and we are good against. <sighs> Once I get going, man, I don't know why he comes outside of the fortress to fight me. That doesn't really make it. Any... All right, so now that that guy said his piece, we're gonna come right under here, up and under the little platform, and go into the halted stream camp. And there's like four bandits in here, not a big deal. Side note, this is a very good place to get iron ore. It actually is the best place in all Skyrim to get iron ore, which you'll go, you're gonna need for transmute. Now, I'm not gonna get them. I'm not gonna get it myself because I'm gonna be using a different method, which is an entire met, uh, an entirely different method. But anywho, let's get down here and fight this chief. All right, now that she's told us all about it, we can come up here to the little platform that the chief was standing on and find this book right here called Transmute Mineral Ore. And obviously, we're gonna have to come down and actually learn it. And now we can take iron ore to silver ore and then silver ore to gold ore. That's pretty much the entire thing. And you can find a bunch of iron ore in here, like I said a minute ago. And then I'm gonna show you guys how to get ore over in White Run. All right, so now that we're here in White Run, we're gonna go on ahead and talk That's to this Adri Adri to Adrian Avenici. Save after you do that, hit her, then load the save. Okay, yeah. So you save, hit her, load the save, and then she's gonna have all new ore. You can do that with anybody in Skyrim, or you can just go down there and buy it the right way. Now I'm gonna show you guys what to do once you have all the iron ore and different kind of ore that you want or different kind of ore as in silver ore. You're just gonna sit here and cast it over and over again. Uh, it takes a lot of magicka, but you can sit here and wait once you run out of magicka. Or you could do the thing where you can make your spells cost zero and just sit here and keep casting it over and over again. And now once you've casted all of the casting you can, you can handle or all of your ore rather, you can come over here to this little smeltery thing, cast you up some gold ore come over here and smelt it into now once you get your gold ore done you can come over here and uh cast the gold smith make the gold ingots into golden rings i don't know how why that took me so long to get out but you can sit here and just keep making it over and over into golden rings not a big deal very easy to do and then once you get the golden rings you're going to meet me up in dawnstar which is right here on the map for step three all right, now that I'm up here in Dawnstar, you're gonna wanna wait one hour in one hour little increments until the Khajiit Caravan shows up. They're gonna show up right here, right where you spawn in when you fast travel, uh, right outside of Dawnstar. And there they are. It didn't take too long there, but now this is the lady of interest. We're gonna ask her what she has for sale. And she'll have 790 gold, and then you come down here to her miscellaneous, and you'll see a bunch of different kinds of soul gems, grand, greater, uh, lesser, petty, all the kinds of soul gems. Now what you're going to want to do, this is just the Dawnstar glitch chest. You can come over here to this area by the mine. You can get this done here and go right here between these two rocks. And you'll see a bunch of different enchantments and stuff like that on this gear. And she'll have soul gems, 750 gold, and the iron ore that you were looking after, and lock picks. Very good little thing to sit here and reset. And she has potions and this and that. Now, we can take the silver ore also, just to have it. 
and then we're gonna go back over to her. We're gonna come over, save, hit her, load the save, ask what she has for sale once more, and she'll have her gold back and everything like that. So this is actually steps three and four, because you can get your enchantments from here too. You just take the uh, enchanted gear that you get from her, and I'll show you what you do with it now. So once you've gotten all of your different enchanted gear that you want, or you're about to be over encumbered, you can come in here to the White Hall. Now, once you're in the White Hall, you can come over here to the left-hand side and you'll see an Arcane Enchanter. You're gonna wanna use it. This is the one we're gonna be using to level up anyways. So, and then you can come down here. I don't really care about that. I don't really care about that. I don't really care about that. I don't really care about, actually, I do care about those. We're wearing those. Uh, I don't care about those. I don't care about that. I do not care about that. And I don't care about that. So, that leveled us up right there to, I don't even know what on Enchanting by itself. That got us to level 30 enchanting just by doing those. So now, once we've got all of our enchants that we want, you're not really gonna have to have the ones exactly that you want. You just have to have something to enchant on your rings. We've got all, say we've got all of our uh, gold ingots, we've got all of our rings, we've got all of our soul gems, then we can come in here. All right, so let's say we've got all of our golden rings, we've got all of our soul gems, and we've got our enchants. Now we're gonna come in here to the White Hall or any arcane enchanter all across Skyrim, doesn't have to be this one. And we can come over here to the left, just like we did a minute ago, and come in here, go. Then we can come in here, pick one of our golden rings. We can pick an enchantment. We're gonna go fortify alteration, why not? And then we can pick a kind of soul gem. Now, I do not know if the kind of soul gem or rarity of soul gem matters, but you guys will have to let me know that down in the comment section below. So that got us up to 38 by itself or 37 so i'm now going to go do this all by myself or all myself i'm going to use all these methods and see how long it takes to get to 100 enchant so let's do this. oh my gosh ladies and gentlemen finally this recording is an hour and 15 minutes long uh anyway that is going to do it for this video we just got uh enchanting to 100 here uh let's go ahead and use all of our uh levels got us up to level 45 uh, just a quick note it took me exactly 216 final golden rings and soul gems now a large portion of that was grand soul gems but i think that with 100 216 with your uh xp bonuses you can do this easily it took me roughly uh 35 40 45 minutes somewhere around in there I, don't, I didn't get the first time the initial time but it took me around 45 minutes to say anyway guys i hope you all enjoyed the video i hope you will all please like the video to help get it out to more and more people to help them level up their enchanting skill thank you all so much for watching but above all else thank you for your time